What's up guys? This is Will of Wheels Gadgets and More back with another video taking a look at a radio alarm clock. So this was sent out to me by a company called USCCE. Big shout out to them for sending this over for a review. This is a radio alarm clock with dual USB charger. Uh, digital FM radio with dual USB 1.1 amp plus 2 amp for recharging iPod, iPhone, and iPad at the same time. Uh, here are some more of the specs on this device here. So this features uh, FM radio, six alarms, sounds, options, nine minute snooze, zero to a hundred brightness level, dual alarm clock, earphone, headphone jack, uh, Celsius and Fahrenheit, Fahrenheit temperatures, and dual USB charging ports. Uh, my box got beat up pretty bad here, but we're going to get into it and check it out and see what we got in the box. Some of these carriers, they don't care. So first thing we're going to get here is going to be uh, our charging brick. It's the type of plug that it has there. Uh, we're going to have our paperwork in here. Yeah, they really beat this box up. <laughs> so inside of the box, you're going to have your user's manual. And it's going to tell you how to set up your clocks, how to choose your alarms, uh, different things you can do. You can use your clock, uh, your radio station as a alarm uh, sound to wake you up, or you can use different tones. And here are all the instructions here. We may need that, but I'm going to put it to the side for now. And then here's the uh, clock, very small in the hand. I can feel very lightweight. So here is the clock right here as you guys see has a nice I'm not sure if that's green or blue sometimes I have a little trouble uh, distinguishing be between the colors so you got your snooze button up here volume up and down radio selector uh, this is where you set your time button here alarm clock one and alarm clock two you got your LED face here uh, you got your two USB ports right here on the bottom, this is where you can put batteries. This uses, uh, I'm going to have to find out what size batteries. Well, let's take this off and see. So this is going to be three AAA batteries that, you, that you're going to have to get. They're not included. It snaps back in like that. So on the back, this is your antenna for, for your radio reception. Uh, you do have a speaker grill here that is see-through right there and so on the back you got a switch here uh, where you can toggle between uh, alarm from for Monday through Sunday Monday through Friday or Saturday and Sunday only you have your uh, selector for 24 hour tw uh, 12 hour time you have a uh, switch here for switch to just show your temperature and Celsius and Fahrenheit this is your second alarm same thing is up there Monday through Sunday, Monday through Friday, Saturday and Sunday. You got your dimmer switch here, uh, your headphone jack and your power inlet right there. So uh, that is pretty much it. Your front, uh, your two charging ports right there. So let's go ahead and get this thing plugged in and uh, check it out. What's up guys? So we're back in. I have power to it. And as you guys see, it has a nice big LED panel right here that's showing your time. It's going to show if it's a.m. or p.m. You got the uh, day of the week, uh, your alarm one. I kind of played around with it and set an alarm right there. You can set another alarm right there. And it's going to show the temperature inside of your home right there as well. And to set the time, you're going to go to time set. Press and hold down on the button. And then your hour will start flashing. And you can cycle through this completely around if you want AM or PM. So I'm going to go AM and then you click it one more time and it'll go to your minutes. And that is that is right already. If you click it another time, it's going to go to the day of the week and you can turn your turn your uh, snooze button. And that's how you set everything by turning the snooze button. You click it again and that's how you set everything. So click and hold your time button and then use your snooze button to rot rotate through your hours or minute or day of the week. So if you wanted to set your alarm, 
you go ahead and, and press down on the uh, alarm one button here and you use your, your snooze button again to cycle through different uh, hours uh, to set your hour and your minutes so I'm going to set an alarm for eight and I'm going to press it again now to let me do the minutes I'm going to do 836 and we'll get a chance to hear uh, how the alarm's going to sound set and then after you set that you can go through and set uh, the tone that you want so it's five different tones that's the first one this is the second one that's the third one like an old clock you got some birds and stuff there and then you got that soft tone there uh, six it's six of them actually so it's six different tones this is the first one this is the second one that's the third one that's the fourth one that's the fifth one and the last one is going to be just your you know, radio tone so after you do that then it's set so we have an alarm set for 837 and we'll get a chance to see uh, how that sounds at the same uh, when it goes off so uh, you can toggle these on so I got that uh, that first alarm is set for Monday through Friday it will wake me up at 8:37 a.m. every day Monday through Friday now if I didn't want it Monday through Friday I can put it Monday uh, I have it Monday through Sunday I should say if I wanted it Monday through Friday I just bring it down one click and then uh, Saturday and Sunday only right there and if I wanted to change my temperature on the front from Fahrenheit uh, to Celsius I could do that but I have it on uh, Fahrenheit and it's 77 degrees in my home right now pretty warm so I'm gonna have to lower the heat it got cold outside last night so so if I wanted to use the dimmer on this I'll just lower it down see it'll go all the way completely dark and this is as bright as it get right here so that is the dimmer uh, yeah guys uh, you can put batteries this can run by battery so there's the alarm going off so I can lower the volume as you guys see or I can raise the volume up goes all the way up to 16 and it's pretty loud So a nice tone right there, if I wanted to snooze, I press the snooze button, that'll give me an extra nine minutes of, uh, to sleep. So uh, pretty nice, man. As you guys see, it is flashing a little snooze, like a moon figure right there. It's telling me that it's in snooze. So another nine minutes, it'll come back and it'll wake me up. So uh, definitely can't really play anything off the radio. Uh, but if we wanted to listen at the radio, Now it's, it's uh, I got it searching, I held down on the button and it's searching for a radio station. I don't have the antenna out so it may not catch any radio stations right here. But we got a chance to see how loud the speakers are. So speakers going to be pretty nice on this. Uh, shouldn't have any issues uh, hearing anything. So let's unravel the antenna and look at how long it is as well. Let's get this little twist off of here. So. Absolutely. Yeah. You're so, great. so there's a station there we're gonna get out of that so you guys got a chance to hear a little bit there I'm not gonna play too much I don't want any kind of copyright I don't know if they'll do that off of FM radio or not but I'm not taking any chances so here's the uh, antenna now you normally just take that and put it up high somewhere and that way you'll be able to receive your channel. So last thing we want to check to see if these will charge something. So let me get a couple of devices and come back. All right, guys, so we're back in. I got a couple of devices here. I got my Google Pixel 6 Pro right here, my Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3. Uh, I do have the two USB-A ports plugged in right here. So let's go ahead and see if it'll charge the Google Pixel 6 Pro. So there it is plugged in. There it is. It is charging it. Let's go ahead and do the same thing with the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3. 
and it is charging it as well. Now just remember this is not going to be fast charge or quick charge anything like that guys. Uh, this is going to be something that you plug in overnight or something like that while you're in bed or when you got downtime and you want to charge it up. Then you have that uh, you ability to do that. Now this comes in uh, three different colors. It's going to come in black. It's going to come in a light color wood grain and a dark color wood grain. I'll drop the link in the description if you guys want to pick it up. Catch you guys in the next video. Wheels, gadgets, and more. I'm out.